Hey everybody and welcome back to iHeart Board Games Live on Twitch. Tonight we are playing Dragon Castle. Dragon Castle is designed by Lorenzo Silva, Jalmar Hak, and Luca Ricci, and is published by Horrible Games and Simon. I am Ronald. And with me right here I have Joe. And our other hosts are here as well. Melissa. And Jesse. <laughs> hey Rex, hey. Creep the wolf. Hey, hey Rex. How are you guys Hello. doing? I was gonna go put up a, a image, but I uh, forgot. Oh. <laughs> I, I was like, I'm trying to like kill. I suddenly like, realized really Jesse's not there. Yeah. And he's like, I was waiting for my cue. I was like, what? Um, what? <laughs> when he said horrible games, like, come on, they're not that horrible. <laughs> Uh, so, Dragon Castle, um, is a game that reminds you maybe of another game that you may have played on Windows 95. If <laughs> you're I've, anything I've like me. have played many times on a Windows 95. <laughs> or if you're from or Asia, maybe you've played it in real life. Yeah. I made the mistake of, we went to a tea shop yesterday, I went with my friend who was born in China, born and raised in China, and I said to her, they had a box of dominoes, and I'm like, oh hey, do you guys ever play dominoes growing up? And she's like... No. I'm like, oh, well, what, what did y'all play? Mahjong. <laughs> I'm like, oh. oh. Really? <laughs> yes. I think it's a valid question. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You can play both. I'm like, I'm I a dumb both. American. I don't know. <laughs> I do have a, a an actual set of Mahjong, like the tile set, but I just always play it on the computer. It's just easier. Like, computer it, resets it for you. Waiting, waiting for your turn on Windows 95? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Did you each have a computer? You just have to wait. Yep. <laughs> and also, she let me know that um, in China, as like part of like feng shui and whatever, they like to always be sitting facing the east. So when you're playing games, if you're sitting facing east, you're the person who is going to have the most luck in the game and the most whatever. Wow. Ooh, what's, so, which way am I facing? Uh, I believe the north. No, no, us are facing east. Though. You're facing north. I think I'm facing north. Yeah, you are facing north. Yeah, that way is north. So then, one of you has to be facing oh, east. Oh, that's why I always. Oh, rats! <laughs> <laughs> that's what it is. Where that's is the compass? Wait, no, wait, I think it's me. Right? Never eat shredded oh, yes. wheat. He's on the eastern side, but I'm facing. Oh north. yeah. Oh, valid. Valid. That's why Joe always wins. I am in the east. Wins. You are facing that east. Doesn't... It is the east, and Jesse is the sun. Yeah. Um, okay, so how do you play Dragon Castle? I'm so glad you asked. Get the compass up. <laughs> uh, Dragon Castle is a game that is inspired by Mahjong. Um, in the game, you are going to be taking actions to collect tiles from the Mahjong board, from the Dragon Castle, and you're going to be using those tiles to get points. Um, whoever has the most points at the end wins. Um, so That's on it. your turn, <laughs> you're going to take an action. The action that you can take, you have four different possible actions, and there's a nifty little um, player aid to help us. So the first action you can take is to take... A, oh, sorry, player aid. That's the player aid. <laughs> so the um, a, first action you can take is take a tile. So first you must always choose one tile from the topmost area. So it may be a little bit hard for you guys to see, but... That's my fault. This I'm is still the topmost to, area. I'm uh, Everdell settings. <laughs> There we go. I was doing some there work. There we are. Ah, so you can see this kind of like top layer up here. You have to choose one from the top layer. And then you must find another tile that matches it exactly. And it has to be on the outer edge somewhere. It can't be like, this one matches to whatever. Um, so for example, I can take this one right here, which is a two yellow. And it matches exactly to this two yellow back over here. So sure. I can take both of those. But the first tile I choose must be from the top. The second one can be different from wherever, as long as it's on the outer edge. So that's first action. Mm -hmm. Action two is take one from the outer, from the top, outer edge, and also one of these little things. Yes, <laughs> it is mahjong with a twist. <laughs> um, the third action you can take is just take one of these off of here and discard it out of the game, and get a point. These are points right here. And those are the actions we're going to be taking through most of the game. Mm -hmm. When we get down to just a single layer down here, a new action is available. And that is to take one of these dragons. It's worth two points. And this is the countdown to the end of the game. 
underneath here is some different shapes. And when this exclamation point is revealed, um, that will be the last round of the game. Um, everyone will get an equal number of turns. So if Melissa, who's our first player, was to draw this, then Jesse, Joe, and I would each get one more turn. But if I was the one who took it, the game would end immediately. The rule book is not very clear on that, but I verified it today with Horrible Games on BGG. Hmm. Um, now, we also have one other thing over here. We have two things that are not recommended for your first play, but we've the three of us have played this game before, and Joe's played many, many board games, so I think he can probably handle it. Yeah. Considering this game is very simple. <laughs> and he's facing east. Yes. Um, <laughs> over here we have a spirit and we have a dragon. So this spirit right here... Well, have you guys ever played with the spirits and the dragon? Mm -mm. We haven't played with the spirits and the dragons. Nope. Well, these are the beginner ones, so it should be easy. Okay. What the spirit right here does is he grants you a special ability. If you discard a tile from your board, you can take his action, which is discard one of your tiles or one of your roofs and trash a tile hmm. on the edge. So you could do that before you took your turn to reveal a tile Something, that you needed to make yeah. a match. This right here is the dragon that's going to grant you more points at the end of the game for whatever's pictured. So in this case, hey Lady Athena, this hey, is actually Athena. Dragon Castle, which is inspired by Mahjong. Very similar. They say in the rule book specifically that they're inspired by Mahjong. So this one tells us you can get an extra point for all of your roofs that are on the edge of your board. Oh, Around the edge somewhere. Yeah. Now, there's a little bit more that I haven't quite explained, yeah. which is as you're building these that. cop these these uh, matches, you're going to take those and put them in your own personal board. So, you know, that example that I gave a minute ago, let's say I had taken this one and this one, like I said, then I would put these on my board and I can put them anywhere I want to, as long as I don't put them on top of... Um, something that's face up. So if this is face up, I can't put another thing on top of it. If this is face down, I can put another thing on top of it, no problem. Or I can put them wherever I want. What I'm trying to do is get at least a set of four tiles uh, that are touching each other, that are all the same uh, color from the same set. If I can do that, then I can earn what's pictured here. So if I do it with these yellow ones, for example, I'll get to put, um, I'll get two points and I'll get to put a little roof on to one of my tiles. If I do it with the blue or the black, I'll get the number of points and I'll get to put two roofs down. If I do it with the purple, I get to put two roofs down and I get a point. The roofs, once you put them on something, it kind of like stops you from building there anymore. You can't build yeah. there anymore. So whenever I make a set of four or more, it behooves you to make more because you can see the points go up. Um, then those ones are called, they're called consolidated, and you're going to flip all of them face down. They would all have to be touching each other. And now I can build on top of that, the next thing that I'm working on. So I just want to make sure that's clear. It doesn't have to match exactly, they just all have to be the same color. Yeah. They have to match exactly to take them off the board, but over here they just have to be the same color. Um, at the end of the game, you're going to get points for your roofs, depending on how high, high up they are. The first level, just one point, the second level two, the third level three. And any level above that, just three. Um, yeah. All right. And all of that information is also here, much bigger. So um, if there's any questions about that, you can look there to see um, about that. Who begins? Me. Any Any questions? Oh, uh, why you? Because I was the last to see a dragon. Oh, uh, last to see a dragon. I mean... There's one on the box. It said outside of this game. Oh, outside of the game. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, I just want to point out uh, once more about the spirit. Correct. You can activate him at any time during your turn. Like it says right here. So. Whenever you want, during your turn, yeah. you may. So you could use him at the beginning of your turn to set something up for yourself, or you could use him at the end of your turn to remove a tile that's going to help your opponent. But just remember, you have to pay one of your tiles to do that. Right. No, oh, I didn't see like a reptile. What well, mine was a mascot one, a mascot dragon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Outside well, of the game. I've never even seen Pete's dragon, so or how you to tame your seen dragon. Pete's dragon. I Jeez, that's that's an old one. I mean, I've seen. Yeah. 
How to train your dragon, right? No. Said what about dragon? The I don't even know what it. I, see, I don't even know what it's called. Was it dragon heart? Dragon. Yeah, with Sean Connery yeah. is the voice of the dragon. Sean Connery. Yeah. Uh, okay, so uh, let us know in the chat if you ever played Mahjong on the computer and which version <laughs> of Windows it was that you played on. Yeah. Trying to figure out what to do. I'm not tired enough to sleep, but I'm too tired to brain. <laughs> I'm tired to brain too today. Just lay reason. back and relax. That's what we're about to do. This one's a very relaxing one. All There's right. There's no chance of AP, just... There's yeah. just not very many matching on the at the very beginning. Well, don't With forget you have bar. other options. You can take a tile and a shrine, oh, discard a tile and get a point. Here's one. Here's this green one here. That's on the top, on the edge. Can match with this green one here, on this edge. Hey, Jesse's art. Hello, hey, Jesse's, Jesse's art. art. All right, Another so Jesse. Well, Jesse's right. been here before. Is that a... Is that damage one? <laughs> I think it is. You change your name? Hey, I always investigate. Diagonal is not adjacent. You did. Correct? No. Ha. Okay, so diagonals are not Got adjacent, so that is that. okay. They're not technically adjacent yet. Nope. Unless I were to put two things here or connect. Happy Cre uh, yeah. National you, Creamsicle Day. Can you put them down here and put them next to each other? You can. Okay. Yes, Just, no if code. you end up with four next to each other, you must consolidate okay. as soon as you have four next to each other. Yeah, but just know, like, right now, these are not, like, if I put something, like, mm -hmm. here, here, that's still not connected, even though it's four, because they're diagonals. Did anyone mm -hmm. have a creamsicle today? I didn't, I didn't know. No, <laughs> no creamsicle today. Not, not today. I had a, I I had a snowball. I had a snowball. Snowballs. Close Where's in. mine? Hope you're doing like, well too, Greybeard. It's actually not much left. I'm using the screen to look on the other side because I can't quite see it. <laughs> That's the problem with 3D games. They look really nice on the table, but when it comes to functionality, it's like, how do I look? Over yeah. The if you're taking it from the top, do you have to take it along this edge, or can you take some from the middle? No, they must have one of their long edges exposed. Okay. I told you, I chose something. Yeah, I know. I'm... I'm reading. Yes, doing doing well. It's hump day. And now it's National Creamsicle Day, too. Mm -hmm. I'll take this guy. And uh, there's one over there. Can you get it for this me? This one? No, the other one. This that one? one? Yeah. It's got to be the swirly. The yeah, little. that is the swirly. They're both swirly, but I wanted it from another level. And go. So, can I take that one and that one? Mm hmm. Right. Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> hmm. 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 <laughs> well, everybody seems to be going for a different color. So, what will you do? No one's taking red. You could start going red. There's, I see that little swordy thingy one. That all the red ones have swords on. I know, but there's that one that matches that sword. Did you down play there. any like, must-own games match. at the con, Ronald? Mm. Oh, we're going for the three sword. I played Rococo, which I enjoyed <gasps> so very much. Did you enjoy it like hundred fifty dollars much? No, <laughs> I I can't do that. Mm. And then we were looking online. It doesn't look like they're going to be reprinting it anytime soon. So, that's we heard. Um, you can just get the rule book, and we can make our own copy. It had a lot of components. <laughs> Very like specialized components. Yeah. Like you know, tiles with dresses on them. That's quite specialized. <laughs> <laughs> I, I Pieces of cardboard with dresses. Yeah, on them. what does make sense? I think we can dress. figure that out. <laughs> I think I can figure out how to make that. We would never do that, guys. Nah. We would never make a homemade version of a game. We would as as always support the... Yeah, what's wrong with that? Because you didn't buy it from the actual... But you can't. not for sale. <laughs> you can't. Mm. Like, even if you bought a... Uh, Indeed. Yeah. Let me rephrase. I would never do that. <laughs> I can't speak for other people. Okay, wait a second. So if I put this here... 
You're trying to cheat already, Melissa? Um, she is. We I'm, all saw the video that got I'm, posted today on YouTube. I'm just <laughs> now putting this one down, okay? These had their spots. I'm deciding. I'm still deciding. But, okay. If, There's no comparison, Greybeard. If I put this Favoring here. Favoring Rococo. Okay, I know. I just wanted you to be clear. Hey, hey Maggie. Hey. Uh, it's called Dragon Castle. It is inspired by Mahjong. Your left hand. Okay. Huh? So, if I put this there here. And then I put this down here. It's still not four connected, right? No, right. Right. Okay. they just have to be touching. You know. All right, doing good. You played this. I'm just, I'm just. <laughs> she's just very verified. like wants to make sure she's not breaking any right, rules. Yes. Right. And take this one and this one. Just verify. That's all. Uh, I was answering the question. Hmm. Okay. I don't remember what the question was. Oh, must <laughs> The Mustang with Mahjong. Oh, okay. Let Maybe. me see what else I, I played, Greybeard. I don't remember off the top of my head. We played Masquerade. Uh, Grim, Masquerade. Grim Masquerade. I do think someone in your group should own that game because I think it's fun. But I'd played that before at Dice Tower a bunch of times. Is it available somewhere? Oh, just one. Just one is a Mustang. I love that one. Do you have that yeah, one? Yeah, we have that. Did you just take the yellow? Mm -hmm. It's Joe's okay. turn. Okay. Mm. I did not enjoy uh, Carson City. Mm -mm. Mm. I enjoyed Vindication. That one was a fun one. But um, I haven't... I I need to play it more. Oh, yeah, your, your, wire, your wire work heart. Yeah, if, if you ever have a desire to have it here with us on wow. iHeartBoard Games, just let us know. Are you still playing games, Jesse? There's a match on that side of this one. Isn't it? I'm curious about the, uh, the yep. change. Yeah, because every time I've seen you online, there was art. Did you? Um, sure. It was not really, yeah. I always say I'm going to play some more video games on here, but I never do. <laughs> We're testing some sound stuff, so if you hear any weird sound, make sure you tell me. Testing a different mic today. And, you know, my experience with Carson City was that it was very fiddly. Um, and I had a teacher who was very, very energetic and very, very nice. Yeah. But that is not necessarily always equate to a good teacher. Mm. Um, Did you just unbox just one? Yes. Yep, just unbox just one. Or at least the video just came out. I unboxed it. Well, it wasn't too long ago I unboxed it. Just one week ago. Just one oh, week ago, yeah. Just one. Oh, I slay me. Just one, just won some awards. It's a tricky title. More, Lisa. I'm going to take this one here. So at this point, everyone keeps just doing the same action. This one here. But don't forget, there are two... There's three, there's two other actions we have available to us currently, but no one has taken any of them. Make a match. Consolidate. <laughs> if you want to. Oh, no. It'd be worth you get more points if you don't consolidate the... Five whole points. No, it's not five points. It's only three, right? Five, wait. One, oh, two, I'm three, sorry. four, five, three six. Oh, oh, it is. The six. Four, five, six, yeah. So you are right, five points. Um, if I got seven or eight, it'd be worth more points. But I'm just... Portraits. Portraits of people? Jesse, do you wow. like sell your art that you do digitally? Like online or something? Everything ever done. No, not right now. But you stream it, right? I'm sure you did. Okay. I'll take this one. That's that's appropriate. And this yes. one. Two. What's the most I should pay out of my salary cap to draft Drew Brees this year? <laughs> what? Asking Ronald specifically. All right, let's go. Uh, <laughs> is he a... Board game designer? 
Can I take or is it a sheet, perhaps? Two? What's your, oh, yeah. I mean, but right. the question is, what is your overall number? Like, how much how much money you're given in the draft to start with? Because each or person... It could be a year-by-year year thing. Because uh, each person has a certain, like, number. Like, a, like, you have this much money in your draft to spend on these many players. That's, like... Uh, but you don't know the scale of it. Like, I guess everybody... Can yeah, but Drew Brees, someone, everybody goes for Drew Brees. He's, He's like first quarterback out the gate. Quarterbacks. Yeah. I'll tell you oh, what, you're talking know. about sports thing. <laughs> but first pick, usually people want a receiver, huh? First. Depends on your league rules. Uh, I'll tell you a secret quarterback says, pick this year. Secret quarterback pick this year is Matt Ryan. Really? Yep. He's playing indoors for the first 11 games. He, when he's playing indoors, he uh, uh, scores high. I'm keeping Mahomes. Oh, well, if you got Mahomes, you're all right. <laughs> but if you want a backup, Matt Ryan's not a bad one. Yeah, and I don't know if he's tier one still. I uh, talking about football. <laughs> Fantasy football is coming up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight. That's eight, eight points. points. Go big green. So she's consolidated those so she can flip them over, and that will allow her to put one rooftop on if she wants. Which I'm gonna put on the outside for the dragon. Let's look at what she's doing. I can't see what she's doing. Why not? Because your hands are in the way. Oh, sorry. Because you have hands. Well, sorry. Because <laughs> it'd be impossible for you to do it without your hands. Yeah. Just think about turning them over and flip them over with your mind. Use the force. The force is not strong with this one. Yeah, you can definitely pick on Ronald for uh, sports stuff, Marvel stuff, basically anything except for... I, I, I have like maybe like musicals. three blind <laughs> spots. The blind spots I have are sports, cars, and like movies. Everything else I, I know a lot about. but Like what part of cars? Anything cars? Anything to do with a car. I don't really, I don't know like the different kinds of cars, like the Chevy Honda or whatever. I don't know the car names. <laughs> really? I don't know the car names. I don't know any <laughs> of that stuff. Yeah. Um, I never challenge Melissa and say something is supposed She'll have those pieces in her mouth a little bit Never challenge Melissa to say something. <laughs> yeah, you were like, yo, try to flip those with your hands. Like, don't, don't challenge well, me. I'll well, you just need transparent that. hands is what you need. <laughs> yeah. And maybe green screen hands. We'll put green screen. <laughs> and then take a photo. And then you flip them. No, that's too much work. Yeah, I think my my absolute like blind spot that I just would not know is like ge this geographic. One. You can't trivia. take that one. Why not? Because it doesn't oh, it have a long edge showing. Jesse's the that's one trying right. to cheat. Oh! Well, no, I was testing you. Everybody was talking and I had to make sure. So it has to have the long edge. The long. One of the long edges must uh, be exposed. Okay. But you could use this dragon's power to, uh, the spirit's power to kill the green one and therefore un open up the pink one. But you have to get rid of something on your board yeah. to do so. Yeah. I don't really want to do that. Um, let's look at the other side. We have, what is that? No. What is that? No. I don't want any of this. Well, you can always take the action where you destroy something and get a point. Or you could just take one piece and get a, a castle hat. Yeah, castle hat. Castle hat, <laughs> yes! <laughs> get a castle well, that hat. That needs to be a shirt. <laughs> I'll take one you of the get, castle hats. You get a castle hat. You get a castle hat. And then I'll take this and this down here. Oh, goodness. Need a, need a little meeple with one of these on its head. It's like, I'm wearing my castle hat, y'all. Mm. <laughs> Joe. Oh, goodness. Wait, zoom back in on it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, we're all using this screen to look over. Eventually, we won't have to once it goes down. Yeah. Mm. Once it gets down to like the very bottom level. Yeah. So I have to take one from the top. Yeah. One of these, okay. Mm -hmm. Even if it's just to discard it. To take that discard okay. action, which is on the other side of your player aid. This one. 
Uh, so don't want to have to pay too much for a tier one quarterback. Save your money for another player. Usually, usually Can I you find... name any wide receivers or running backs? Uh, I used to. I used to could. Back I don't in watch like, basketball, so no. <laughs> I used to could back in like you know Peyton Manning's day and with the Colts, I could name some of the people on his like Super Bowl or team. football team. Can you name a football team? The Dallas Cowboys. Okay. Yeah, pretty much. If you're That's not it? a, if you're not a Saints, you, you said, could I name a football team? Name yeah, I two. Yeah, there's 32 uh-huh. total teams. In there. No, of course not. I probably can't even name five. Let's see. I could wait. <laughs> You'll know them all. That's no. not fair. <laughs> I, I probably don't know them all. I know there's no the New Orleans Saints as well. Mm-hmm. It's true, but I don't know what the team in Alabama is called. There's a the one. Alabama yeah, don't Tucson one. or something. There's a one. No. No. Some Saints don't have it. <laughs> like Tucson, Alabama. whereas California Tucson, has like Alabama. three. Now, what kind there, of a system is, is this? There is a Phoenix <laughs> element. Phoenix, yeah. But yeah, like some states have more than I one team, and then so some states have none. Florida has three. Florida California Gator. has no four Gators. Now? That's high. That's college. No, they lost Florida. one. Florida. Oh, they lost one when the Raiders moved to Vegas. Oh yeah, did they, they the really? Bears. Yeah, I forgot. Oh wow, you I didn't think. know that. I know that was the biggest Woo! news. No, actually, I had no no idea. About time though. Yeah. Okay. Well, Florida, they have like the. I will. Is the I can take buc- this one and this one? No. The Buccaneers, no. right? Neither of those is on the top level. Oh, that's on top level. Ready for college football, no. definitely a top three sport. So you're probably oh. a big fan of. I mean, so that's Alabama. Get rid of one. I know of another team that I didn't name LSU. That's college. Yeah. What so are the there's, other ones? So there's those hundreds of college. What's schools. the difference? The National Football they don't League play each other. versus, you know. That's dumb. College. <laughs> College well, league. one's a bunch of kids. And yeah, the one's a, a bunch college of students and one's pro. <laughs> okay. um, one builds to the, the other. One. Yeah. One gets paid, okay. the other one's so we do? everyone around you them. You put it face paid. down over well, there in your area. might get scholarships, uh-huh. and you which get is point. technically paying. paying for their okay. education. Right. Uh, yeah, but a lot of more it's people definitely are not a lot more money off of that. It's this. definitely not like a pro level Have pay. Have you seen the stadiums? Ugh. Melissa. Okay. What's it gonna be? I know you already have your turn planned out, right? Oh, yeah. what's that little cloud thingy? Oh, it's not the right little clouds. Have you guys discussed the new BGG logo yet? Yeah, I, well, I don't think we've discussed it on here, but I just don't really have anything to say about it. I mean, I, I couldn't care more. less. <laughs> I just... Don't care. I don't even notice most people's logos. What? I mean, Jesse's well, a graphic designer, so. It's yeah. nice that they finally decided to update. <laughs> yeah. Maybe they'll turn their attention to. They said they're updating the website, too. But yeah, they've but been they, saying that for 10 years. All they did was, like, update the look of it. It's still functional the same way. They just changed the CSS to. Yeah. But I mean, cleaner. I was hoping it was going to be a, an ongoing thing that was, like. To keep changing it, yeah, yeah. to get refined a bit. I it's, think they're, they're going to say, same. "Well, we said we change it. It changed." Oh, you can't get, I can't yeah. get that one. That functional. I can't get this one. Though. No. Uh, it doesn't seem like it would take much. Cheese and pizza are many options. They should options just move the whole left. form system to Reddit. <laughs> just have a BGG Reddit. This is a conundrum. Or a bunch There's of. There's just not many left. It's better off on its own. Because otherwise it's just like randoms coming in. Sure. Random yeah. people come. Random people. I mean, random people can still come in. Random people like, I'm in the board games this week. And they come I'm in. I'm at the, like, the format system. The uh, the forum format. I'm going to take this one. It seems like it would be easy. And, to oh, and a little way. house hat. Thank you. The people that come in and they go like, oh, we played Catan yeah. this weekend and I loved it. Tell me some more games. And then they never come back. Yeah. <laughs> I use BGG so little that I didn't even realize there was a new logo. I just I don't use wow. it often enough. I'll use BGG about once a year for the flea markets for a convention. That's about it. It's just the orange outline of the geek guy's face. Yeah, that's all it is now. Just an orange outline of his face. It just I don't even remember like what the other blob. one was. It just kind of looks like a blob. A blob with sharp edges. Yeah. Did, have you ever checked your gold? 
Because I sent you a bunch because I never used I've it. I've always had gold. Yeah, I never but I, use it either. I sent you all my extra. Oh, this one? <laughs> yeah, oh, is this one? Because I was like, I'm never going to use this. I already had a bunch. Well, they sent me a bunch because I donated to them one year after, like, after the flea market. Like, I did a donation and they sent me a bunch for New Year's. Like, here, here's like, thank you for being a. They do that. That, that happens thing. to everybody. Yeah. <laughs> but. Like, when I did my little donation thing, they, like, sent me some. And then I got some more after the new year. And then I got some more for some. Like, when am I ever, What do you use all this gold for? You can use it to buy uh, different perks on the site. See, I don't use the site enough. So, I didn't, sure. I didn't You can even any. use it to, um, yeah. Well, I use some of it um, for, uh, like, my little picture thingies. My icons. <coughs> but it wasn't that much. What do you think about it, Greybeard? What does the chat think about it? Do you have an opinion? Or are you like me? I played with it in Photoshop. Just did some things with it to make it look better. I didn't post it anywhere. I was just seeing what I could do with it. And I just added some glasses to it. And it looked, at least it looked like a face at that point. Hmm. It's becoming an issue. What? I will take this one. That's it? You, you get... Oh, the little hat, please. Thank you. Here's your castle hat. Yay, Got a hat. my castle hat. I'll take the storm cloud. All right, Joe. Oh, yeah, you're looking at this. I'm looking at this <laughs> There's someone with a good logo. Is uh, the Derpy Dragon on TMG's logo? Oh, yeah. Tasty like, Mitchell's I like that little dragon. Dargon. He's so cute. And they kept it the same for a long time. I, I couldn't even remember what the other one looked like hmm. after they posted it. I'm like, I. I that's how much I pay attention to logos. I didn't even remember hmm. what it looked like before. It's that guy. That same guy. The geeky guy. Yeah, the I, geeky guy. I wonder how well I do with that board game, the logo one, like logo board game. Huh? Uh, I, used to, I used to have that. Yeah, it's like with all <laughs> it's the. It's not really about logos. It's more about just businesses. I'll take okay. that one. A oh, hat. I find there's Facebook comments about everything these days. Oh yes, everyone wants to express all of their opinions. As loudly as possible. They have not been left with many options because we have to take one of those three at the top before we can start. Well, two them. of them have matches on the board, so. Yeah, but. You can always kill one and take a point. Where's the fun on that? It depends I'll on what one, I'm take left with. Like you've been doing. But they don't match the colors that I've been taking. I'll just take this one and this one. Bluey. It goes face down in your area. Oh. Take a point. Melissa has nine points. Joe has one point. Jesse and I have zero. But that will change. I'll take a hat. Very soon. Look, I mean, you're all, you're all are building. A hat for you. And now Joe gets the run of the table. <gasps> it's true. So many more options. But are they the options he wants? Probably not. Mm -hmm. yeah, never wider than a mile. A lot of Facebook comments on it. Yeah, I've been seeing them. And people have been offering their versions of it. I, it's a good marketing okay. move. <laughs> Something that a lot of people really if, wanted. If I do so I complete this... Here, right? Yeah. Yep. Six. You'll flip all those over. So and that'll give you five points. And because it's green, you can put a hat out if you want. And if you remember the edge, if you put on the edge, the dragon will give you a point at the end. 
I'm on the edge of my job. And the yeah. dragon's gonna give me a point. <laughs> Wearing my castle hat now. I'll take this one. And this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, you get the eight points, like. Nice. Like I was saying, see, I said not for long. Got built. Mm -hmm. Had stuff happening. Consolidating. Right. I'm taking. Such a low energy game. This one. <laughs> so chill. And this one. At least we're not brain burning like we were in the past. Pretty much. True. All right, so I put one here and one. Hmm. I'm on the edge with you. Hmm. Hmm. Jesse? I'll take that strong cloud over there and this one. Shut the leaves. Thank you. So stormy. So meaty. What's that from? An Arby's commercial. No. Oh. Go ahead. This one. But they have the meats. Okay, that one. For sandwiches. Wait, what, what is this one? It's the lowest level, the red. Take it. it just gives you one hat. And two points if you finish it now. So I'll do it. Two points for you. And you can put a hat out. I'll take a hat and this. I'm going to take this one and this one. Last time I played this game, I went all black strategy, and I lost my bahum. Badonka donk. Badonka donk. Mm hmm. Take this yellow. Eh. This one. Take this blue one. Eight points for that. Consolidating. How many points do you get? The eight? There's eight, yeah. I couldn't think of a better word than consolidating. Something more thematic, maybe? Mm -hmm. mm, they call it consolidating in the book. Something's off. That was there. Oh, this is not a spot. That's what it was. <laughs> I was like, something's off. <laughs> and like, did you want to put out a hat? A hole there. Yeah. Um, what color was it? Cello. Oh, so you just go one more. Yep. I'm gonna complete this area, which is worth just two points, please. I'm taking this one. How? Melissa. Oh, that! I was wondering how you took this, because I didn't see that up there. On the top. Are we sure bottom. about that? <laughs> Considering you keep trying to take the bottom levels? <sighs> no, one was from the top part. We're going to have to rewatch this. Post oh, in the comments if no. you caught her cheating. Because, you know, she does that. <laughs> I didn't know! You did, though. <laughs> what she <laughs> means is this. she knew, but she just didn't see. All right. She chose to ignore it. I didn't realize until that had already happened. I will take this blue one here. And a hat, please. Now take a hat. I got lots of hats. If you're watching this on YouTube, uh, take a drink every time Melissa cheats. <laughs> For extra fun, watch it on two times speed and you'll be like, yeah. <laughs> 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 I, whole lot of cheats. I only tried to take the one piece. That's an anime. The one piece? One piece. Oh. Hmm. Okay. This one and a hat. So if you're wondering why Slivers isn't here today, 
I heard um, No Man's Sky, the VR pack, came out today. Ooh. So I imagine he's... Do I, uh, do I, have, to, would I have to consolidate it if I put it there? In yes, you, you would. You could put it here. True. If you didn't want to consolidate yet. Not yet. And start getting up on that next level. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. I only got the one hat. True. Oh, and the blue ones give you multiples okay. or something. So you can get right. Yeah. So in the next one you take, you can take one and a hat. I mean, this is just junk, 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 and more junk. <laughs> I don't. I need blue and pink, and there's no blue or pink. No, I need black and blue, and there's only just that one blue. Oh, well, dear. I'll take this one and a hat. Sploosh. Mm hmm. Surely for the point. Um, let's see. I don't see any of those up there. I'll take this and a hat. Okay. Um, I just want to point out the spirit can only be used if you discard a face up tile. Oops, this is this. I'm just cashing in the four point or the fours for two points. Dang it. Hmm. And then there were three. Mm hmm. Um, yeah, I'll put this here and get a hat. There's only two choices. Mm, I know, but we're going to be the ones at the bottom. <laughs> and I don't want you to go picking the other stuff. And once again, Joe will have his pick. Hmm. Sword would only give me the one sword. I guess I don't know. I'll take it. Let's go. Here. I mean, you could have used the spirit to kill that tile and then had your choice. But you have to Fair. take something off your board to yeah. do it. Yeah, and I got mm -hmm. a lot of good stuff here. But at the same time, you make a good point. I mean, just as an option if you don't want that stupid sword. How am I helping him? You, I could, don't dis know. you could discard and get a point like I've been doing. I'll take a hat. Good. Whoa. Joe's now getting in the pink game too. <laughs> Very late in the game. There ain't gonna be enough pink for all of us. <laughs> yeah. Uh, talk amongst yourself for a second. I wonder what Ronald's gonna do. Hmm. He's looking up some sort of rule. I mean, I'm an expert at this game. I can tell him the rules, but I guess he doesn't want me to know. What it is. Well, I, because <laughs> the rules say what you should do on your turn is the first thing you should do is take a tile. So, for example, take this tile. Mm -hmm. And then once I've taken this tile, decide what the second thing to do match, hat, or point. Oh, you're wondering if you could take the one within. Yeah, can I take that one and then take that one? Yeah, I think so. Well, good. That's what I'm going to do. 
Because I don't want to be stuck with the pinks. Yep. There ain't enough pinks for everybody. Nope. Um, Especially since I Joe bought it. <laughs> right? <laughs> He could it was want, barely enough for you and I. He could want yeah. he could want them potentially to use the the to little trash the a, trash power to like have something to throw it for. away to trash something to get what he wants. I mean, so he I could still five. use them. True. Just reducing how much five there. is worth. Five gives you three, three points. points, and you could put down uh, double hat, right? Pink. Pink is two hats and a point. Yep. You got a point. Yeah. All right, I'm taking this one. Mm-hmm. I'm not doing well. Well, let's, uh, why do you gotta be a pain that Because I've got to fill this void. But couldn't you just take the two here so I can have two? <laughs> so now I can't get the two. So you've got some stuff there, okay, Melissa. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six so points. Six points. And I get two hats I can put down. <sighs> Well, rats. Guess I'll just take this one and a hat, please. Actually, this maybe not this one. What else can I take, though? Guess this has to be this one. So I'm just gonna get six points. Oh, that was a black. I get to put down two hats. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's why I did it. Two hats. Hmm. It's Joe's turn. Okay. So it's two points and a hat. It's a hat. Um, sure does get tricky trying to consolidate these tiles. Mm-hmm. It'll slide everywhere. <laughs> well, no. Everybody's going for blue also. I'm not. Boy, I'm just like not picking the right colors. One there and one there and consolidate blue. Oh, three you points. Consolidate. And you get two hats you can put, but you don't I don't have hats. hats. Alright. Um it was more important to just get those to me. Melissa. I feel the same thing's gonna happen with me. I find it most important to get these two blues while I have let the pickings good. Put them right here. I just put out the one hat. And get the two points. Swords and swords. And stones. Mm. Oh, we're good, Drew. I think. Do you want that? I can't do that. Dollar, dollar bills, y'all. G money, so, G money. G money. How's it going? Dollar, dollar, dollar bills. Just playing a little dragon castle. It's very relaxing. It's it makes me in. talk slurred voices. So what you're saying is we should not play Takeda on the channel. We'll all be like. <laughs> At least you're traveling in that. This one we're just kind of sitting here. <laughs> trying to face east as hard as possible. Yes. Yes. Are you getting in the yellow game right now? <laughs> well, yellow is at least a common thing. There's only five of them left. That's enough. He only needs four. He's got two. Not bad. Hmm. Have you heard about that game Blackout Hong Kong? Hong Kong? Of course. I almost got to play game it. Game Nerds has a sale on it right now for twenty bucks. It's on a it's a game I would like to play. It's a Euro game as I understand. Uh, um the guy who made that game up there. Oh my goodness. Oh, that game. Freedom Service. 
Oh, Alexander Pfister. That's it. He made that. I love Alexander Pfister. Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's your turn. So, yeah. I mean, it's like $5 shipping. I was thinking, like, $25, bucks, i am going to get black up. But apparently, it's the first printing, and they're reprinting a whole new version. So, it's like, your may as well turn. wait. We took these. Wasn't a big fan the first go round, but my friend bought it, so I'll definitely give it another go. Okay. For 20 bucks, that just seems. Yeah, it seems like that's what's so worth trying. cheap. Yeah, because it's, I think, $60 game or something. They're, they're just unloading stock. It's called Blackout. Hong yeah, Kong. Blackout Hong Kong. Oh, Blackout makes me think of playing bingo. Bingo. Playing bingo, and you do a blackout board, so you have to see who can get all the way and fill out the entire board. And the first one to fill out. I'm going to take this. the board wins. Versus like regular bingo. And I'll take a hat, please. Thank you. So if we go, they go back around, they're going to pick up the, the points probably. At the end, or can they only take that once? Nope, we can take it as many times as we want. Mm. It has a 7.6 on BGG. Yeah. It's pretty good. Oh, it's an economic game. Area control. Oh. <laughs> Area control. I like the designer. Area control, card drafting, deck building, dice rolling, hand management. What what is this game? It has everything. Oh, Dexterity, throw burritos. <laughs> like, oh no. Maybe egg rolls for me. <laughs> oh goodness. And lots of not very memory. pretty on the table. That's I believe why so they're odd. doing a second printing with new art and stuff. That's yeah, the guy who taught me vindication had it in his stack, and I it's really a pretty to play game. It, but... Okay. Yeah, yeah, if you take price, that, like I'll this, end the game on my turn. It's like the price of yeah, a used game. Yeah, it's pretty good. I mean, You're going to get one more turn. Yeah. It won't end right there. That'll be the last round. Unless it's because you're last if player. I'm last player and I take it, then I end the game. Oh, but if I took it, then all, the rest all of us would all get another turn. Yeah. I so want to throw burritos. Me too. <laughs> I'm going to take this. Why would anybody this want one. to throw the burritos? I want to eat the burritos. <laughs> All right, Ronald, what are you going to do? Are you going to take a dragon? <laughs> He's going for it. Something. This is ratchet. I don't know what is, what's going on. I'm tempted to take those yellows just to stop you from getting it. <laughs> That's probably a good strategy. And he just abandoned his blues over here. He could have gotten so many points out of those. I'm shocked. Well, I didn't realize your bales was going had blues because I... I've been slowly building them. Well, there's still a blue there. You could have trashed a yellow to kill the red to take the blue. Yeah, you could connect your blues with that one. Oh. Well, continue. Sorry. I'll take this. Take that. All right, so it's Melissa's turn. What will she do? I've got to take this. I have nothing. Oh, she's got nothing. That brewing. is her last turn. So this will be my last turn. Yeah. Well, how about that? I had to leave it packed up to my daughter's birthday at the end of the month, but then she opens the base game and the Kickstarter edition double four burritos. Ah, nice. Four burritos. I'm killing this tile to use that guy's ability. Mm. Kill this. Mm. And take this. Mm -hmm. And we'll put it there for two points. Uh, what did you take in addition to that? A hat? Um, because you don't have a match for it, so. right? Um, I guess the hat then. Yeah. You have to, yeah. There's nothing else. And uh, did you get your two points? I did, I think. Yes. But I didn't do it. I don't think I got the extra point for the purple. Yeah, you didn't get that one. Did you um, get two hats? Two hats, yeah. One here. If you put on the outside, you get a point. Yeah, but, but same difference. If you put on, I yeah, mean, six of one at that point. No, you get two points if you put on the two tower. And two points if you put it on yeah. the outside. Oh, way, that's, oh yeah, yeah. So. This looks nicer with higher towers. All right, I'll trash this one. Why do I keep helping people? I have no way. Well, he needed to do that. The only hope he had. <laughs> so that's yes. seven. Mm hmm. Six points. 
I'm gonna cash in some of these to Well, I don't have a money. way to make points other than just to um, take this, so I'll take this. And that's, that's the it. end! The end! It's the end of the game as we know it. Alright, so I'm gonna get my calculator out. I suppose I should too. So you get your base points are all the things that are sitting here, all the little tokens and stuff. Right. And then you're also going to get points for each of your stacks that has a hat on it. Depending on how many tiles are in that stack. That's what is a hat? You get. The roof. The roof. The roof is on fire. Yes. yes. Um, what is this game called again? Dragon Castle, is it? So I just got eight points because I have the one point from the dragon We're all and counting. the one. So is that just... Best part of the game, the counting. I think I'm done all counting. Done. That didn't take long. <laughs> the ones on the outside were two, right? There were, yes. Th those yeah. levels are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's plus one point if it's on the outside. Okay. Yeah. So Which but and plus this? That is the, so it's oh. worth one point plus one for this. Yeah, so there were two each. Yeah. Okay. One first level. So 24. 24. I have 32. 31. Ah, Melissa. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Is that right? Uh, 1, 2, probably. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, that's what I thought. That's why I counted. I have 33. <laughs> 33. What did you have? 31? 31. And Joe had? 24. 24. What? Those darn yellows! Just confirmed? Let's see. Yeah, that's 19 points. 19 plus 14. 33. Mm. Hmm? Yes. Huh? Yes. What? Yes. What? Yay! Boom, boom. That's me, I won. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. I commend digital boom. calendars button four pack. There's a big plus button. A uh, minus yeah. button, a reset button, LCD never display. So basically what you're you talking about it. is a calculator. Well, <laughs> it's also an LCD counter. I mean, it's, yeah, this is on a very high score. No, it's a quick that. game. So Jesse got 33, I have 32, Melissa has 31, and Joe has 24, but he's never played this game before, so it was a learning game for him. This was a quick version of it, because we played this before and got like 55 points, 53 points, like two players. Though. But it's a two player, so you're taking a lot more, you have well, a lot a more options. Board. Yeah, you have a different board and you have different options of colors because we're all trying to share the same amount of colors that two player Yeah. Would the last be time I played this game, I got 32. <gasps> you are keeping the consistent. Same. That you'd like to get better, you'd well, think. But, but you can, at least you're keeping consistent. You know? The winner got 37. Yeah, and you're not back peddling. <laughs> So that's Dragon Castle. Yay. Yay. Nice, nice, quick little game. That was very nice. Quick. Nice look mm. to it. Nice. Compared to that slog on Monday. Mm. Yeah, we're trying to balance it out. I'll be yeah, able to go to really? sleep uh, at a regular time. Yeah. Wait, Monday? I mean Sunday. And he's talking about. Tomorrow. No, I'm talking about Everdell. And Nick yeah, Ever thing. Oh, Everdell's Monday. Uh, wow. Sure I wasn't here on Sunday. Yeah, I was okay. in Austin, yeah. Texas. He's that's talking right. about like a counter, like he just like. Yeah, it's after. Like, yeah. Ah. Okay, that sounds good. That sounds fine. Yeah, that's true. If, money. You, if you're counting during the game, that's yeah, like good. I was just kidding about the calculator thing. <laughs> I knew there weren't really calculators. I was just trying to make a little joke. Um, it makes very dry humor. Yeah, I, I have very deadpan sits of humor, and people sometimes don't realize I'm I'm joking when I say things. I'm just flat <laughs> affect. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> we'll be using an abacus next next week. Yeah. yeah. I need wow. I need a little sound. Oh, good I need a sound machine near me at all time, and every time I say thing, just rim shot. Did you? <laughs> you know, <laughs> that was a joke. Um, I use an abacus and a Magic the Gathering for my life yeah, total. Yeah, I have a uh, black. I like those. Mine was black. Yours was green. Great. No, man, I should do a math on abacus, not just counting with it. Like, oh, like doing well, the, counting's the, the doing, best thing. Doing the, uh... So these were just the basic. Um, 
ones that we played with. There are more advanced ones, a whole big stack of them. So that changes the game. You can also design this a different way. There's a big board that's just a blank board, and they have all different kinds of designs you can play with in the rule book, depending on your number of players. They recommend different uh, ones, just like the Mahjong on Windows 97. <laughs> so what do you guys think about Dragon Castle? I really, I really liked this one. When we first played it, we played it at a place... Oh, what was it? So the, the, Team the tea. Victory. Yeah, Team Victory. Houston, Texas. Yeah, and so we played at this like cafe, and it was just something we kind of pull, pull off the shelf. It's like, oh, why don't we play this one? And I really liked it. I liked the the feeling of the Mahjong you know, inspired pieces and playthrough, and it was easy going. And so when I saw it available in the flea market, I went ahead and decided, oh, yeah, it's a good price. I'll go ahead and pick it up. And I like the pieces. Everything is, you know, really good, you know sturdy pieces the only thing that i wish was a little different are these boards because i always feel like when you go to try to flip the board they're like sliding all over the plate i, just, I don't i wish there were i don't know i mean i know it would be more for the cost of it but i wish there was like like how um in T terraforming mars when they made those broken token tray like wooden trays so that the pieces stuck in I know, there but then so you'll be like around. trying to flip it over and yeah you'll, you'll, it'll get stuck but you know, you're the most OCD person at this table, so I'm not surprised like, to hear that like from you. like a little wooden tray with like little pieces, and you just kind of like was, place them in there. Were, you have to like go back and do some. Yeah, do it's some like they're all sliding around. It's Joe like, oh, is the least OCD out. person yeah. over here. I'm like in the middle of these two because I'm a little bit OCD, and when Joe puts his stuff that's out, that's kind of like. But I know, but I know yeah. it's not worth it. I'm just yeah. like Joe. Come it's on, like come on. Clean it up, man. Wooden, Clean it up. I want a little wooden tray. Keep, 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 keep them all together. nice, like nice and straight. But well, I, I think it's a fun little filler game. Yeah, I, I think mean, it's that's all being right. that's being picky. Um, eh, at most. It's okay. Yeah. I don't know if I'd ever recommend it, like to play at a game night though. I'd play it and somebody recommend it to me. I'd play it as a filler. I wouldn't like walk in and be like, tonight I'm playing Dragon Castle. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we yeah. have some, we, yeah. since we got it from the, the convention, it's come out at least at least one, if not two different occasions yeah, by people who just wanted to play it because if they never played it before and know that it's an easy filler, they'll pick it off the shelf. It, it has good table presence and it's something that if you know uh, my song, uh, yeah. yeah, it's it, you're going to. I be think. able to pick up on it. I, would, I think number I would, nine is a valid comparison to this game. I would choose really number is. nine over this. It's faster. It's faster. That's right. It's easier to set up. The thing with number nine is people do not it's understand. Harder, harder for Melissa that. to cheat it. That's true. <laughs> oh, I've seen her cheating it in number nine too. What? What? I did nothing. Because there's space underneath there, Melissa. That's a zero yeah. underneath there. It's got yeah. a hole in it. Yeah. No, I haven't done that before. Oh, okay. I was just but kidding. I will say that people do have a problem just. You know, with the, the understanding that that bottom level scores nothing. Mm -hmm. It's like that's the hardest thing to remember is like, you know, bottom level oh, yeah. nothing. And then you build. Like, then it's one. Then it's two. Because they want to times it from the bottom. Like, that's... But it doesn't do count. that. Well, let's talk about what we have coming up. Yeah. All right. See how works? Yay! We did it! Yay! All it takes is just one conversation, and then we're on the same page. That's it. Uh, <laughs> oh, you know. and you must said that game is perfect for his little counters. You know. Oh, like, for sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so on Sunday, I will not be here. We will have a special guest, DJ from Board Game <gasps> Gumbo. It's going to be here in town Very visiting nice. with these guys. And he is bringing a special game, which is currently on Kickstarter. Yep. It's called After the Empire. After the Empire mm -hmm. from Gray Fox Games. Go check it out on Kickstarter right now. Yep. Or wait till Sunday and see how it plays. Do both. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> you don't want to miss out on the Kickstarter. Don't want to, you know, Sunday comes right. around and you when miss is out. It, when does it? Yeah, when um, it? Yeah, it just went live on Monday, so it'll be up for another week and a half. You got time. Mark that remind me button. That's what I always do. Yeah. And then watch um, us play it on Sunday. There's a bunch of little castles you assemble yeah. and stuff. So it's Castles, cool. kind of like dragon castles. Oh, yes, oh, exactly. We got like a those. castle thing coming up. <laughs> So uh, we could have worked that thing better. You know, speaking of castles, yeah, speaking of castles, <laughs> we did castles not choose this. Sunday. We just found out we're playing that game today. So, yeah. so on <laughs> Monday we will be playing Res Arcana with four players. Oh, nice, fun, fun, fun. I never, I don't think I played it with four. Oh yes, we did. We played oh, yeah, with we did. Uh, John yeah. and his wife. Yeah. So that's a fun one. That's a little um, card game, economic it, game it, thing. It's the same person who made um, Race for the Galaxy. 
Yeah. Sliver's actually introduced Tom us Lehman. to that one. Yeah. yeah, it has just nice little card card game. Too. And then on Wednesday, we'll be playing Royals. Royals. That's a week from today. Royals. So definitely you tune in for that. Queen. Now Probably you know. In that game too. Ah! <laughs> you know, one of the things we I'm love to do. I'm never going to live this down. <laughs> ever. One thing we love, love to do is point out that Melissa cheated. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, but really, one of the things we love to do around here is spread the board game love, yes. uh, yes, which it means is. we love to raid over to other board game content providers here on Twitch and, uh, you know, introduce you guys to other cool streamers on the platform. So um, when we get over there, make sure you let them know the hard board game sent you and right. put those meeple emotes into their chat and let them know where you came from. Um, who are we going to go see today? We're going to go return the favor to Board Game House. They just raided us the, uh, on Neverdale, actually, on Monday. Sweet. So we're going to go right back. They're playing Five Tribes. See you later, G-Money. Bye, G-Money. Bye. G-Money, later. But uh, until next time, the box is closed. closed. We'll see you over there at Board Game House. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye, Bye everyone. Bye, Greybeard. Bye, Greybeard.